so we just saw l value was defined as an expression to which a value can be assigned it was also explained that an l value appears on the left side of an assignment therefore an r value can be defined as an expression that can be assigned to an l value the r value appears on the right side of an assignment statement see unlike an l value an r value can be a constant or an expression as shown here see you just see in this uh, this thing integer x comma y x equal to 1 1 is the r value of <clears throat> x is a l value y equal to x plus 1 x plus 1 is an r value y is an l value as stated in my previous question faq 9 an assignment statement must have both an l value and an r value therefore the following statement would not compile because it is missing an r value suppose integer x x equal to void underscore function call so function void uh, void from <coughs> returns nothing that means there is no uh, integer or uh, associated with it where whereas x is x is an integer right when it is not associated with it it would be considered as an r value it it would be considered as an r value because it evaluates into something that the l value x can store if a function had written an integer it would be considered an r value because it evaluates into something that the l value can be stored now it is crystal clear that <coughs> the difference between l value and r value r value is the one which can be associated to an l value thank you